Listen, God knows what you did last night, and he still loves you, and you're still part of the family, and he didn't kick you out. God, God knows the thoughts you were thinking, and he still loves you. He didn't kick you out of the family, okay? He loves you. You are his child, and I think that would be the second thing he would say. He'd say, I love you. I love you. If you just whisper, man, you'd lean into the whisper of encouragement. I think he'd tell you, agape, unconditional love I have for you. I believe he'd say something like this. I'm so proud of you. I am so proud of you. Some of you, some of you think to yourself right now, there, wait a second, Pastor. I haven't really done anything to make God proud of me. Well, that's because God doesn't see you for what you're doing. He sees you for who you're becoming. Remember, he is the beginning and the end, you guys. He sees you differently, who you can be. And I don't look at my kids on, for, through the lens of what they're doing. I see my kids through the lens of who they will become. They might not be acting like it, but I tell them, man, you are a leader, not a follower. You are a world changer. God has a purpose for your life. You got a calling on your life, even when they don't act like it. You know why? Because I see who they're becoming, not how they're acting. God sees you. And I'm telling you, if you just lean in and hear the whisper of God, he'd tell you, I'm so proud of you, son. 